the PGMOL have got huge, huge issues right now. David Coots has been suspended by the PGMOL for a video that dropped during lockdown, which has been released, and it is a blatant Liverpool agenda. It is honestly insane. I can't play the video for copyright reasons, but I'll explain what happens in the video, what he says about Jurgen Klopp, and what he says about Liverpool. Before we get into it, make sure you go down, drop a like on the video if you haven't already. Make sure you have subscribed to the channel. The road to 50,000 subscribers is well and truly on. We are steamrolling our way there. Now, this story is absolutely insane. David Coote, a Premier League referee, has been suspended today. Now, what's interesting is one, what he says about um what he says about Jurgen Klopp, two, what he says about Liverpool. It is absolutely insane. You know, I can't play this video for obvious reasons, but as you can see, I'm going to share it. Sky Sports News have tweeted in the last hour, breaking the PGML, PGMOL, ask, uh, say they are aware of video circulating online, social media, and they are investigating. Following up from that, it has been reported that he has now been suspended. So essentially what he says is he thought Jürgen Klopp was a C word. I'm not going to say that word for obvious reasons. And he was unimpressed with some of the stick he was getting from David Coots with regards. Um, Jürgen Klopp was very unimpressed with, with David Coots' decision-making. And then David Coote was not happy with the way Jürgen Klopp reacted. And he called him a C word. Um, it goes deeper than that. This man right here was the guy that didn't send off Jordan Pickford for nearly breaking Virgil van Dijk's leg and damaging his ACL, which meant he was out for a year. The same referee that didn't send off Leon Bailey the other night when Salah was through on goal. Darwin Nunes ends up scoring from that attack. But if he didn't score, he didn't even wasn't prepared to even give that as a foul. Fabrizio Romano has put Premier League referee David Coote has been suspended with immediate effect pending a full investigation. The PGMOL make no further comment until that process is complete. This referee right here has an agenda. We've all seen it. Doesn't send off Pickford for, break, for nearly breaking Van Dyke's leg. The same referee that, that gave a penalty for Martin Odegaard handballing it in the box when it was not. The same referee that didn't give a penalty towards Everton when Rodri handballed it in the box. This is absolutely shambolic and adds to the mountains and mountains and mountains of mistake going up against the PGM PGMOL. It does not look good. But there is a serious Liverpool agenda from this man. Four instances off the top of my head where he does not give Liverpool the right decision. It's honestly insane. Honestly insane. Now, there'll be a lot of Arsenal fans out there that will be furious because they will feel they've been hard done by by a lot of decisions this season. I can't believe, I can't believe we are sitting here, right? Nearly, we're a month away from 2025 and the Premier League refereeing, the standard of refereeing in the Premier League is absolutely shambolic. Genuinely, it is flipping insane. We have got the best league in the world. We've got the best product. There's world-class teams out there like City and Liverpool and Arsenal that have competed on a very, very high level. We've got a very good standard of, of, of professional football. The league is far superior to La Liga, Serie A, Ligue 1 and, and, other, and the Bundesliga in terms of watches of viewers every single week. Yet we have got some of the worst officiating I have ever seen. Genuinely, it is absolutely mind-blowing. It's mind-blowing that we're sitting here with, with, with this many viewers watching the Premier League, with this amount of talent, with this standard of sporting on football, and our officiating is diabolical. And now the Premier League have suspended 
a referee because of a video he made online during lockdown. What on earth was you thinking? One, to come out there and slate Jurgen Klopp. Two, to basically discuss your blatant agenda against Liverpool. And three, do not ever think that you, someone's going to be recording it and that it's not going to be posted later down the line. That is absolutely, genuinely, I I, I can't even, I, I can't even explain the stupidity from David Coote to think that this would not go global. And I'm just going to bring up some examples. This Liverpool Twitter account has posted this. Um, Liverpool FF have posted four pictures uh, that they are aware of from David Coote's refereeing. And you've got Rodri's handball, you've got Odegaard's handball, you've got that Pickford injury, and you've got Sadio Mane being set, being offside. And look at that. How can you give that as offside? This is all decisions from David Coote, whether he's been in the VAR, the one that's given the offsides, whether he's the one on the pitch making the on-field decisions. All four of these, that is a penalty categorically for Rodri. That, that decision, um, which should have been a penalty for Odegaard, that is the most blatant high challenge on Virgil van Dijk and that offside. How you can be a Premier League in the best footballing league in the world with some of the best players out there in the world and we have got such diabolical officiating blows my mind. We all saw at the Euros and the World Cup how good the officiating was. We all saw the standard of refereeing, how quick the offside decisions and on-field decisions were made. This right here is absolutely shambolic. It is honestly insane. I have not seen anything like this that in terms of poor officiating in a long, long time. And Sky Sports have put a video out in the last hour basically highlighting that he will be investigated. And let's be honest, is anyone surprised? Look at how bad these decisions are. Like, all jokes aside, and three of those involve Liverpool players. It's a Liverpool agenda from David Coote. I am glad, very, very glad that he has been found out. He's an absolute idiot for making that video. Stupid, stupid, genuinely. Let me know your thoughts down below. Does this help fans to try to get across their point in how bad the Premier League refereeing is? I don't personally think this makes Howard Webb look in a great limelight right now, looking at he's one of the guys that constantly defends the refereeing, saying that the on-field decisions he thinks the referee is, you know, he normally goes with the referee's decision. When you've got one of your best referees or so-called best referees out there blatantly hating on a player or players, a club and a manager, he calls Jurgen Klopp the C word multiple times. Madness. Absolutely insane. Honestly. His refereeing career is over. It's absolutely over. Like, yeah. It'd be very interesting to see what happens with regards to Howard Webb. Is Howard Webb going to come out there? Obviously, he's one of the main faces of the PGMOL. Is he going to come out there and address, you know, the Premier League, address the fans of the Premier League? Is he going to apologise to Liverpool? You can't have a referee called a manager. Well, their ex-manager, multiple swear words. It's just one, it doesn't look good for you. Two, is bad for your PR. Uh, and three, you, you can't call a fellow professional in your sport that. You just can't. Let me know your thoughts down below um, on this entire situation. Make sure you have subscribed to the channel. The road to 50,000 subscribers is well and truly on. Over 90% of you are not subscribed. So what are you waiting for? Get down, hit that subscribe button. And I genuinely can't believe we're sitting here in 2024 with referees insulting players. It's absolutely insane. 
Make sure you drop a like and I'll see you all soon. Thank you for watching. I am out.